Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn, where, for some reason, this, um, campfire is located right next to this guy, who doesn't seem to be alarmed by me being here, but, anyway, um, so I think, quest-wise, we're gonna... This one. Oh, it's a mystery, so I want to know what it is. After I do this one, we'll do the main quest. Um, but, well, actually, I might actually take this time, this moment of time. Dog, he literally comes over, opens my door, and then leaves because it doesn't shut. I'm like, thanks. Thanks. He just wants to poke his head in and then walk away. It's annoying. I might take this time to go try hunting some boar. So, we'll see how long it takes. I'll have to look up where's a good spot to go boar hunting, I guess. Because this is frustrating, not having stuff. Not having the room for stuff. Alright, apparently there's a quest that I didn't know because I never look in the errands section uh, called Luck of the Hunt, which is your... Oh, wait, I have gathered four boar skins, apparently, but apparently I have to gather the ring. I got this from somebody at Mother's Crown. Heck if I remember. Heck if I remember. Well, apparently, this is a good place to farm boars. According to the website that I looked at. Um, and, yeah. Hard to tell the tracks apart. But this was tame. And a boar. I wasn't even paying attention. Where's the tracks at? I guess we've got a quest, so... It's not marked. I wonder what killed it. Both are in the mouth. Where? What are you seeing right now? Oh. Well, I got so some cool ring. Let's see here. Well, that would be potatoes. Gross. Okay, so we got the ring, um, but where are the boars at? I don't see no boars. I'm gonna have to go boar hunting. Check it out. Floating. You saved my life. I, I promise I won't waste it. Okay. 
I mean, you had a couple people here. Oh, I need lance horn lenses. Hang on. This is why we're here. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, we did it. Okay, but now we just gotta make the room. So I'll just drop a couple things. Uh, at least one thing. At least I can pick it back up again. Um, I'll drop some sticks. Thank you. All it took was doing this quest. Uh, crafting. Carry capacity. Resources satchel. Freaky. Finally! That's it? A hundred items, that's it? Ugh. Well, we finally did it. All I had to do was follow a quest. <laughs> that would lead me right to it. Um, I don't... None of these I'm super worried about, to be honest. Uh, when I get there, I'll get there, I guess. But I have plenty of space now. I can open treasure boxes. Ugh. Finally. Pick up that. Pick up my wood. I dropped some more wood over here. A little pile right next to where I killed this thing. Perfect. Alright. Freaking finally. Alright, let's go let's go return this really quick since we can. I'm just gonna run back. Here's the thing. I found one other, one other one like this uh, yesterday when I was running around. Uh, this is definitely the best free dating app in the Pharaoh store. It's a lonely world out there. It's a lonely world out there. Sometimes you need a little high tech help to find your one and only after wading through the oceans of apps in the dating and romance category. We're confident we found the coolest, maybe also the nerdiest <laughs> one. RP Gree. RP Gree. That's awesome. Graphs of familiar mechanics of role-playing games under the messy category of romance, and the result is, a lot more, is a, the result is a lot more fun than you might expect. Users gain or lose experience by going on successful or not so much date. Not so much dates. After each date, users are invited to give their prospective partner one of many ratings, such as orc, NPC, minus 10, so the orc is minus, orc is minus 25, NPC minus 10, and starting character plus 10, or multi-class wizard thief or hots plus 25. That seems so, like, I would rather date an orc, depending on the orc, you know? Like, eh, just, like, judging people by their appearances. I guess that's what dating apps are about, though. The app is a little intimidating to users in the early going who wants to date at level 1, but it doesn't take long to pick up a few levels and earn a little more attention. RPG greets, augments, augmented reality interface is pretty fantastic as well. Activate your focus, open the app, and suddenly the stats of everyone in your vicinity with an RPG greet account are displayed right there next to them in real space. That's terrifying! Like, what the heck? I wouldn't... I don't want people to just be able to, like, look at me and, like, see all my dating app history. Like, what the heck? So you're gonna strengthen your flirt game at the calf shop. Not, oh, okay, calf, like, uh, coffee type thing, caffeine. RPG greets got you covered. Tech breakfast is legally required to know if I that the above content was paid for by RP Greet and does not necessarily reflect the actual opinions or experiences of the tech breakfast or its competitive contributors. Anyway, that's funny. Dating apps are for scrubs. 
I don't think I know anybody who's met anybody successfully on one of those. I'm sure that people have. Like, had a, had a successful... I guess your de definition of a successful relationship on there can be very... Like, some people are like, I'm literally just here for sex. And you can probably get that pretty easy on most of those apps. I took the hard way. Uh, I like to challenge myself to go up the middle of the freaking waterfall. Just let me Skyrim, dang it! That game has ruined me from most other games. To be honest. Alright. Random person. How did you fare on the hunt? I've brought you the boar skins and your lucky ring, Tame. All mother be praised. And you, uh, of course. Where did you find it? Halfway down a boar's gullet. Not so lucky for the boar. I think I'll wear it around my neck from now on. That seems like a good idea. A generous reward box. Nice. All right. Oh wait, what? Oh, okay. Um. So now I am actually I'm gonna look at the errands really quick. Oh. What? That's the guy. Yeah, he was like, oh my gosh, just stay in or out. You stupid. That's the guy who gave us the idea in the Karja homelands. Sanctuary, no, we decided not to do that. That one did seem interesting. That one, right. Gather a snap mall lens, that's right, I don't have that. Collateral, <gasps> shoot, no, we're gonna do collateral. We're doing collateral, change plans, we're doing collateral. Uh, I totally forgot. Why is that not in, why is it in errands? Why do they differentiate between errands and side quests? I mean, is it, is this, a, this is, this one isn't even a fetch quest. The rest of these, yeah, you could maybe say are like sort of fetch questy. This one better not be a fetch quest. Anyway. Time to travel all the way over here where I don't have any... Wow, I didn't stop at that one. I'm dumb. It's fine. Can I travel here? No. Wow, I'm dumb. Fine. I have to buy more camping. More camping supplies! Okay, we're in the area. Which is unfortunately really close to a trampler site. Uh... So what we're doing, Olin begged Aloy not for his life, but like his family, held captive by the Eclipse's leverage. To find, uh, explore the Sparklands to find where Olin's family is being held captive. It looks like... You know, I don't know where he is. Mm -hmm. If that's like the exploring one. Oh, it looks like it is. And then talking to Olin is secondary, but I, I will, I'll talk to him. Yeah. You picked a nice spot to hide, my guy. Sorry it took me so long, haha. -ha. Hey, you're a woman of your word. Olin, your family. I saw the threat from Helis. You have a wife and young boy? If I'd have striven to keep them safe instead of all I've done. This is your chance, Olin. That's why we're here. I'll take it. A kinder deal was never struck. They're being held close by? Yes, the farmstead just beyond these rocks. I'll take you. That's it. Nestled against the spurflints. Um... Hold on. Best Let me... not to think about the previous owners. 
Okay, I ex I explored. Okay. <sighs> Too late. Too late what? He said something about best not worry about the previous owners. What is he talking about? Whoa. So this is it. I can't bear being so close, and yet. It's almost over. How many Eclipse are we talking? From what I've seen, a fair few. Well armed and armored. I can hit them with the thing, I Bowman think. watching from the ridges. But there's no space for their machine demons. You've been watching for a while? What's the best way in? You think if I had a head for strategy, either of us would be in this mess? <laughs> Fair That's point. very blunt of you. We could storm the front gate, Asram style, or take it from the sides or the ridge above. Maybe you could get on the rooftops. Not me. I'm too heavy cast. Heavy cast. Nice. That's very, very metal worky of you. Should I do this alone? I don't doubt you could. But with the Eclipse, there's always another blade at your back. So I'll watch yours if you let me. Oh, I hope this isn't. I hope this isn't like a huge deciding factor, like you know. But let's go. You have my steel. Like I'm gonna ruin everything, and his kids will be like, "No, daddy!" Or his kid and his wife, and I'll be like, "Frick! I had to restart." <laughs> Okay. Okay, tag. No, not that. That, that kind of tagging. This has to be where they're holding Olin's family. Come on. There are not that many. Oh, and I see his... I actually thought maybe his wife and kid would be, um... Dead, to be honest. But, uh... Looks like they're still alive. Hang on. I can maybe get this guy... We can maybe get this guy down, who's down low. No, I don't feel comfortable with that. Maybe I'll try up top. That's a boss type person. Can you see me? Okay. He's in the bushes. Concentrate on your target. Whoa, whoa. Get behind something. Oh, my God, are you serious? Oh, wow. 
wow, look at you go in there. stealth this out, but having my friend here makes it so that I'm not stealthing so much. That's fine, though. He was a good distraction. Okay. Did I not kill you? Oh my gosh, I can't kill it. Why? Oh, it's with me. It's an unkillable boar! Why? Oh, I ran out of room. Hello, what do you have? I don't even know what good that is. Stuff, I don't have to worry about not having enough space. Except for traps. I don't use traps very often, this so I'm not later. mega concerned about the trap situation. I think I already upgraded everything once except for like weapons and whatnot because I don't use them. Find an entrance to the what? Oh no, it's right, he had the things. Wait, 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 what's up here? Wouldn't it be funny if there was an entrance to the cellar from up here? So nice to not have to worry about my space. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Alright, no entrance to the cellar from the top. Maybe there's an entrance to the cellar from the bottom. Hmm. I guess it wouldn't be... Can I go inside of a building or... can't usually go inside buildings. Yeah. Oh, sandstorm. I was like, what happened to my lighting? But it's sandstorm. Is there a way behind the building? Hold it tight. One of the Eclipse must have the key. But, oh. Are you serious? Oh. Is there one hiding back there that I didn't see? Ooh, look, I can climb. Okay, climb, climb, climb. Do it, do it, do it. Okay, that's right, I killed this guy in the bushes. Yay. Off we go. Get out of the sandstorm, rescue a wife and kid. It's been a good day. I thought they'd be dead. I don't see why they actually would keep them alive. You untied yourselves. That's crazy. Hello. I'm glad you had your family back now, but I, can I talk to you? Oh, oh, my wife. My child. Aloy, I owe you three debts deep. Thank the sun. You found us. I found someone who had the courage I hoped for in myself. It's she who deserves your gratitude. I have much to confess. I accepted a devil's bargain. And others paid the price. And do you think I don't know? I heard them talk. You know there's always been dirt on my hands. Now there's blood too. Take your son up in those hands. Come back to the claim with us. You should listen to your wife, Owen. But Helis... And his demons. I am honor bound to help you, Aloy. With what little honor a Dyson like me has. Olin, whatever your debts, you don't owe them to me now. Go with your family. Show them you're a better man. Farewell, Aloy. Is his? Your mother. I hope you find her before they do. Okay, so it was very a very basic quest. Okay. Damn wind. Never cared for being pushed around. Yeah. Hey, there's also a boar in here. I think he started out in here, and I'm a little confused about what a boar is doing in here. Now that I now that I think about it, I'm a little confused. Uh, let's 
level up some things, maybe. Hmm. Doubles the capacity of the medicine pouch, increases the time. Chance for extra resources. I don't really know. Maybe. See, and I don't. How much is that? Three, really? These last two or three? Wow. I have yet to like do like I have strike from below. And it, oh, humans! That's right. I was trying to do it to machines last time. I have yet to use that, even though I love that. I haven't really done any of that. And I'm not often on ropes, which is, it's cool, but I don't know. I do want that. Faster reload by using, yeah, 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 I want that. I'm, I'm saving up for that one. Well, there's that. So that really was, like, I thought it was going to be, like, a big story-driven quest, but it wasn't. Uh, can I craft? I can craft travel. Oh, look at me. I forgot you don't have to just buy them. See, so we've got. I haven't done that one yet because it's in a terrible spot. This to get the Forsaken Village. Well, let's see. Uh, let's go. If this is all I really have to do. Yeah, oh yeah, he's the guy I met in the city. We'll see. I'm not actually sure what my timing is on this episode, but we'll go talk to him really quick. If nothing else, it gives us some XP and an extraordinary loot box. Still need to find a, uh, maybe I'll take... After this, maybe I will actually run around and try to find... What is it? The turtle? I need the turtle heart or something, whatever it is. Not Snap Maw, but somebody else. Those turtle hustlers that run around in caravans. I need one of those. I need its heart. And I can't buy one because then I wouldn't have enough money to buy the armor. Oh, well, that's a good idea. I could take a machine out of combat by tying it down with the rope caster and try to take care of other things first. But it won't take, it takes the bigger ones break out pretty quick. Although if I get that shadow one, that should be, make it a little easier. The savior of the Sun King. Whoa! You would have the marks. Very well then. Congratulations and welcome. Our members reap rewards and adventure and I don't live remember on it. in legend. Am I a member now? No, you're only a fledgling. Junior members are called thrushes. To join and become a thrush, you need a senior member called a hawk to sponsor you. So I need to find a hawk. Okay. Yes, but a hawk can only sponsor one hunter at a time. And I'm afraid most of them already have This one. was unexpected. I've overcome more sods. Where do I start? Upstairs, present yourself to the sun hawk Assis, our leader. We should introduce you to a hawk. I hope it's worth it. What do you mean? You'll see. Oh boy. Uh, well, there, I do have a fetch quest in here. I didn't even... I don't know if I was able to come into this room before or not, but I didn't... I thought I was just going to talk to somebody and they were going to be like, Oh yeah, sure, you're part of it now. But apparently this is, this is an actual setup. And I guess that one guy was saying that I met in the marketplace. He was all like, I don't need their fancy hoity-toity. Whole blue that they got going on is big. Is that a? That's a thresh, or one of those threat, like one of the big ones that I was seeing earlier. Oh hey, look. record of a red mall. Yikes! It's long. I, I, me. Record of red mall. I'm sure it's legit. Hang on. Are you the leader? Are you the leader? Excuse us. Ah, 
the machine rider, graces us with her presence. Hi. You're Anora, are you not? A fighter from the savage lands. The sacred land, but yes. I fought for everything I got. Huh. Tell me, do the Nora often wander into other people's homes and do whatever they like? Of course not. But that is what you're doing, right? What? Now. Stinking up our lodge, pestering your betters. Ha ha! You're hardly my better. Legan said I had to meet you to become a member. That would be true if there were any chance of you becoming a member. But you're a savage. And no savage will rise in the ranks of the Hunter's Lodge. Fight me, bro! I am the Sun Hawk. Now be gone. That's really no. just what? I was yeah. to believe there are rules here. If they count for nothing, then even your position is meaningless. Oh! So quit blustering and tell me. Is there a hawk who is free to sponsor me? Woo! Very well. Talana is free. <laughs> that was Wouldn't easy. That be fitting. Trash sponsoring trash. Now get out of my sight. Hmm. Hmm. Like, what's the point of like having like a meritocracy if you only if it, it's not even it, be, it it loses all meaning? Like, oh, it's a meritocracy. Only people who deserve to be here get here until you realize it's actually like institutionalized like nationalism, like racism and all that. Like, it's not really racism in this case. It's more like. Uh, being oh what's the word just left me ethnocentric you know it's like you're not gonna you're not gonna you're not gonna get the best of the best if you limit it to one pool of like candidates like I don't know what well, th th this whole thing this whole hunter's lodge loses all any and all, she's right it loses any and all meaning once you let like I like, think the best of the best just kidding only of this certain group that I in particular uh, like it's like, okay, like, so everything is meaningless and nothing means anything? Oh, hi! Here, Talana? Vassi said you were a hawk without a fledgling to sponsor. Or are you trying to drive me off, too? It's okay, I've dealt with worse. The lighting got different. Mm. I'll bet you have. But you're wrong. It's not okay. Especially not today. Oh, okay. What happened today? One of our own just died fighting Red Maw. You'll never face a more dangerous Thunderjaw. Cuts through trees, rocks, people. I'm sorry to hear that. It's part of the hunt. Okay, she's got a really cool headset on. Assis, what's his story? He's the Sunhawk of the Lodge. The highest ranking asshole <laughs> no. member. He's taken down Ravagers, Stalkers, Behemoths. So, I've taken down a lot of machines. As have I. Even brought down two stormbirds. That's something. But he's a hawk who brought in the trophies first. And that's how it works. That doesn't Whichever make any hawk sense. Beats the greatest machine first, becomes a sun hawk. What? Isn't... How does one become a hawk? When a hawk dies, his thrush is promoted in his place. No matter how anyone feels about it. What? So you're a thrush until your sponsor dies? Who is, who is this? Legan? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, what guy? Legan? He's a hawk. He had an impressive run in his day, but he doesn't fight anymore. He supports the lodge in other ways. Unlike the she's other a... hawks who hoard all the best kills and drink the bar dry. He, she's beautiful, by the way. Like, I really love Is there her any style. actual hunting in this lodge? Yeah! So far, it's been all talk. <laughs> yes, of course. You fight a machine, then bring its trophy to assist the Sunhawk. Then no one can deny you brought it down. I'm ready to hunt, so tell me. What do I have to do? You want them to regret looking down on you? Then speak to them in their language. Kill three sawtooths, two ravagers, and a stalker. Deliver their trophies directly to Assis. That should shut them all up. So if I do that, you'll sponsor me? I'll consider it. Just to make Assis boil. <laughs> What's the story with her, though? Like, with... Him not liking her. Like, as he's not liking her, you know? Uh, the hunt is the noblest pursuit in this. These are so long! Without three half sons, one in honor. Uh, only seven hawks? 
So this is a very, very exclusive clientele. Only 14 people at a time plus a Sunhawk. Oh, in the event of the qual the quality of prey is in dispute, the hawk who hunted first shall remain first as sun hawk. Only Kaja males of pure blood may become thrush hawk or sun hawk. Is that why she's disliked? Because she's a woman? Because she's. But I saw another one. There's a woman here. Uh, there's a lady here. Maybe? No? Okay, man? Maybe? I can't tell. Uh... Only those two? Maybe? Only those two girls so far? There's Osiram in here! Car, you guys are... Maybe... Are you literally just like... I thought he was dancing in a corner. I think he's stretching in the corner. Hmm... You might be a woman, I can't tell. You're definitely a woman! Hmm. Hmm. Alright, we have a quest over here. You're a woman! But she's probably not, like, officially part of the world. By the sun! King of Odd's edict really is taking effect. Never thought I'd see a Nora here and a woman at that. What? What? So, you have marks for me? What do you mean? From the hunting grounds. Oh, right. You're new here. Eh? What eat it? He must have changed the rule. that the Hunter's Lodge had to welcome everyone. Man, woman, outlander, regardless of tribe. Ursa, captain of the vanguard, came in and delivered them. <laughs> you should have been there. It was glorious. <laughs> I figured they would sweep it under the rug and say no woman or outlander qualified. Yet here you are. This is the only place I think I've seen where there's been a differentiation between like man and woman, like with man being the one who's like totally 100% in charge. I think that's what happens. Like, it actually happens anthropologically too. Like a lot of tribes, um, like tribal, like clan type people, um, before like, uh, before like agriculture becomes like hard set, you, you know. Um, when they're more like, or even if they are, but like it, 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 it just. They tend to be more either egalitarian or even matrilineal, uh, like matriarchy type style of like uh, leaderships. But then once like everybody starts settling down and like I don't know I don't know what it is. I haven't really I haven't looked into it a whole lot, but it becomes this thing where like the guys are like all of a sudden decide that they're cooler and they're gonna kick everybody else to the curb and that for some reason like, people who were equal to them are now inferior? It doesn't make any sense. It never has. It never will. And it's totally false. It's 100% false. You know? Obviously. But, like, I don't know what it is about... Like, because obviously the Karja are supposed to be more technologically advanced, you know? And, like, more intellectually advanced and blah, blah, blah. Except they're not. They've stunted their growth by, like, by, by, by restricting half their populace. Like, could you imagine how much more advanced we'd be as a society if women hadn't been, like, repressed for, like, millennia? Like, that's twice the amount of brains with the, uh, and, and a, a completely different perspectives working on different projects. We'd be, like, we'd be light years ahead of where we're at right now. We'd probably be in space right now. Like, if, if we hadn't done that. But no, like, yeah, guys are like, Bah, I have uh, problems and I can't handle it and uh, blah, blah. And they're like, I can't handle if a woman is as good as I am. It's like, could you please get over your small penis syndrome and whatever infantile issues you have and just let everybody live, please. Anyway, it's interesting that, that it's interesting that, that is somewhat reflected in this game. Are you a member? Me? No. Karja don't exactly encourage their daughters to run around hunting machines. But all the changes in Meridian have been good to me. I don't think the Osaram know how to sell to us Karja. The trader I worked for last couldn't sell flowers to a bee. He was too plain hammered, as they like to say. This is a much better job. I figure I'll be able to open my own shop soon enough. Wait, what, so she, was she like taking advantage of the Osaram or no? Or she just was working for the Osaram? I don't know. What do you want with my marks? You hunters and your badges. I'm not gonna take them. I'm going to give you a weapon Woo! that sets you apart. 
Yeah, I thought that again. Yeah, you good girl! If you earn marks in all three trials at each of the 500 uh. rounds, come to me. I can give you up to three weapons. One for 15 half suns, no! one for 15 full suns, and one you'll love for all blazing suns. I only have three. No! What do I do with these marks? If you get the same mark from all the hunting ground trials, I can give you a hunter's lodge weapon. Show me what marks you've earned, and we'll see if you qualify for one of these special weapons I have for please you. Please let me, please. I'm a little short on marks. No, no problem. Once you have marks from all 15 trials, you'll be able to get the next Hunter's Lodge weapon from me. Oh, don't tease me. Hmm. Uh... <laughs> oh my gosh. A blast sling, war bow, and rope casters. Oh my gosh. You tease me, woman. Jeez, me. Uh, no, I'll never do the tutorials. Oh my gosh, you get XP for doing the tutorials. I could run through and do all these tutorials. Haven't I done this? Yeah, I've done this. Oh. Are these done or no? Like, it's hard to tell, I guess. No, it's like they're... Open to Do I have to like click on it and then go do the things? I don't know. This is dumb. That's dumb. Because I've done these things. I guess I should just. That's dumb. I have to like have it active or something before I do it. But look at all the XP I could get. Jeez. Anyway, I should probably I should probably go. This one maybe went a little bit long, but we at least got to do something that wasn't as big as I thought it was. We also started the Hunter's Lodge, and I really like our new uh, possible sponsor. I'll have to go kill some things for her and present my spoils to her and the Sunhawk guy, who I'm gonna kick straight out of that window. I'm gonna kick him right out the second floor. I'm gonna Sparta kick him. I'm gonna Cassandra Assassin's Creed his butt out the window. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I very much appreciate it, and I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in the next one.